before. Let me get in the lobby montage. You got it. Stream game. Alright, there we go. Alright, I'm gonna... Alright, stream started. I... They're good to go, yeah? Yeah. They're good to go. Alright! So... Neck versus Don't Swear. Neck's been picking up it lately. Like, I want to say this, like, past, like, month, three weeks-ish. Uh, Don't Swear rocking fish, as usual. So... I actually haven't seen much of Neck's Idol. I've only, like, seen it, like, once or twice, like, playing the friendlies, but... You know... Oh, gets hit on, on the way up. Still able to keep a little something going with fair. Sorry about that. Oh. Update the land. There we go. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. All right, cool. Uh, next got a pretty good idol. Um, he definitely been playing it a lot more. I know he's a big fan of like doing like some of the more unconventional stuff because he he likes to look cool. Of course. Next, next, all about the looking cool. Ooh. Oh yeah. It's hit with bad DI on up smash. Oh, yeah. that dash dance. <laughs> no grab after. This is gonna be a huge punish, I think. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Decent edge guard. Not able to catch landing behind. with flex. Was able to. Uh, I might be. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know by how much, just because I'm using the spectator in game. Yeah, hard to say. I'm at 640. Oh yeah, I'm like five seconds behind. Something yeah. like that. Crazy. Hopefully, uh, Nickelodeon fighter will have better spectating. <laughs> God. I, I hate spectating so much in this game. Sometimes, it's definitely not perfect. Yeah. Oh my god! That was the worst DI I've ever seen. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> that was okay. Neck holding the ledge. The, the tea bag. All right. Oh no. Yeah, that's it for this game. All right. We're already getting into game two. So yeah, don't swear. Pretty solidly winning last game. Neck didn't really get a lot of opportunities to just get, you know, like, it'll's like good punishes started. Mm, it felt like uh, Neck was dropping edge guards at times. Yeah. Uh, Neck uh, landed butt off stage, I think, I want to say like twice, and uh, Neck didn't, really didn't convert off of it, didn't really try to like get as much distance as possible to keep that edge guard going. Just like hit yeah. butt. Went back to ledge, hit by go back to ledge, which like that you you definitely need to extend yourself after but that's one of the yeah that does best he might stage. he might not be used to the like the t oh my god <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> or <laughs> or uh I was gonna say he might not be used to the timing for that was back a Johan moment <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah he sh don't her should be dead oh no man next. Neck really could have taken the stock there, but he didn't go out. Yeah, it feels like off stage, Neck is, isn't really like trying to extend their pressure, try to make it scary for fish. When that's really what you need to be looking for, you know, those fish killers. Yeah. Uh, you know, as as, bear, as you know, the like name that. fish killer implies, it is really good at dealing with fish off stage. She can just throw out butt, and it it since um since fish doesn't really do much off stage. You know, little side B and jump. Yeah. It just covers whatever he's gonna do. F like, Fish has a lot of set options that he needs to do in order to uh, recover back to ledge. Yeah. Ooh, I like the ledge trap there. All right. Oh yeah, bomb ledge trap. Sick. Uh. 
I, I like that Neck uses bomb a lot, actually. Bomb, bomb is like a, a, a pretty cool thing currently. Yeah, bomb is a super cool tool. I, f I feel like a lot of people misuse it, but I can do a whole lot. Um, I think it's. I don't really see. I mean, the only uh, idol I see really is Husky, like at a high level, and he doesn't bomb much. So I, I don't want to say it's like an underexplored area, but it's definitely. Oh my god. <laughs> Once we're with the, yeah, the nice finish. That dumbbell finish. That is 2 0. 2 0 for don't swear. Oh, oops. And uh, best of five is uh, what section of the tournament? Like top four, top six? I'm not sure. I'd assume we've been doing top four. Oh, who is Husky? Is Husky. Husky Sad Man available? So I don't know if you saw the tournament last last week, but Husky went 0 and 2. Really? Yeah, he lost to Sad Man in the fish ditto. It's pretty funny. Yeah, he lost to. <laughs> it was a. Uh... Definitely not what anyone expected. Um, yeah, right, oh, okay, dude. they're here. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, Husky going idle this time. Alright, so... So they're, they're, they're in their voice chat right now, probably just having a grand old time. So, uh... Yeah, H Husky idle versus fish. This is... I mean, this is one of those matchups that Husky knows so well. So I actually yeah. did not. Oh watch wait, wait! Tell them not to start. Oh wait. I I have the the dot ping on Husky. Oh no. Oh, they got it. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna load in. Hold on. I'll be right back. One, Husky, stop! 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 Yeah, stop! Wait. Stop! What's up? Stop! Why? What? Stop! Hey, I didn't load in. I got the dot thing. Oh, oh my god, god. Alright, I told them. <laughs> Bias. God, this is biased. Right, not much we can do while we wait. I can actually finish updating the overlay. Uh, Husky. Sad man. Alright, so now they're starting. Wait, are they starting again? I'm not in. What? Why aren't you in? Because I, I disconnect. Did you go tell them to stop again? I mean, like, we're already. Like, I'm... they've already, like, started. They're, like, a stock in. I'm not oh gonna my... stop that. Oh my god. Why didn't they wait? <laughs> Ah. Uh, well, can you describe what's going on in the match? Yeah, I got you. So, right now, Husky's a stock up. Uh, Fishman is in the corner, uh, able to flex out. Uh, the main thing right now is that, like, Husky's high percent. Sad, sad Man is at a, like, mid percent, pretty much. Uh, sad Man's able to, like, actually, like, get some conversion and take a stock, so now it's three to three. All right. Uh, Husky has Sadman off stage. Uh, not able to really get anything off of the bomb that they threw. So, <clears throat> Sadman's definitely—he's been making a lot of improvements lately. He's a—he's uh, mm -hmm. on the come up. He kind of just oh, does like a. Sadman misses an up B. So now this is a. Uh... 3 to 2 Husky's favor. Husky's at a very low percent still, 38. Uh, let's get a high percent again. Salmon able to actually uh 
even the, even it up a bit more. Oh, gets hit by bomb though. Uh, Flex is out, and now it's an e even stocks yet again. So, Sadman's actually keeping Husky off stage for quite a bit. Oh, but Husky lands bear. I was gonna say, Sadman likes to do a lot of... A lot of silly options as fish. I know, fun Oh, for play. sure. <laughs> yeah. Um, Sadman's kind of a... He plays really... Weird, I wanna say. Like I think the I think the way that Sadman plays reminds me of Truefish almost. Yeah, I like, like someone who just like picks like really funny options. All right, the game's over. All right, all right. Spectate. Right, yeah. Oh, wait, I have to I have to leave the lobby. I don't know. Why do you Why do you have to leave? Because I got the ping glitch on Husky. Oh well, okay, hold up. Is it right. for you? No. Oh my god! Why don't people win? I mean, it's because, like, we assumed that the set would have happened. It did <sighs> stop- it did pause for me. Like... <sighs> so they- they are playing. So you need to get in. Yeah, I- Okay, hold on. Fading. Can you guys stop? I'm not in. <laughs> well, not my fault. What do you mean you're Mom, not in? I'm... Oh my god, they're... They're not gonna stop. I'm so upset! God! <clears throat> That's so annoying. So Husky won the first game? Yes. That's, a, that's Husky 1 out. <sighs> I wish Spectate wasn't broken. I really hate this. Sorry, chat. <sighs> As far as like the status for the game right now, they are uh, Husky is up one stock, up two stocks now. I'm gonna go get a drink. All right. that. <laughs> if I clip what? Alright, so how's the game going? Uh, Husky 4 stocks sad just now. So, I thought the set's over. So. Unless it's best of 5, which I don't think it is. I mean, it's not. Alright, best, best of 5 starts at, uh, top 4. Okay. Yeah. Alright, so or, uh, do we have no, any- Top 6, my bad. Do we have anything to stream? Uh, I guess we can use Sadman. Right now, Caden. Uh, mm -hmm. Unless. I believe. Yeah. Uh, uh Bumblin and Rev. Yeah, they already started. Started their set. Yeah. Great. Where'd, 
Where'd Sadman go? Why did Sadman leave the lobby? Alright, there he is. Uh, waiting on Caden to join. Yeah, Kaden then. Oh, he's in. Alright. That's Kaden, a new player. They just started playing, uh, like, last week, I think? Alright, spectate this. Yeah. Um. And. Alright, so Caden's an Asha. Um, and, I mean, that, that much can be seen. Uh, for being new, he's pretty competent. Um, he's he definitely I can tell he has like platform fighter experience. Um, one of the things I will criticize about his gameplay though is he's very very teleport happy, and yeah. I mean, that's was, kind of the new Asha experience, right? Yeah, you know, teleport's so exciting, it's flashy, looks cool, it's really good. Uh, it's mm -hmm. like... I think Asha's, like... On the surface, Asha's a pretty simple character. Like, he doesn't have a whole lot um, going on mechanic-wise. You know, he doesn't have clutch at all. Uh, all of his moves are very apparent why they're good. Um, but teleport's, like, one of the things that makes him really difficult to like be very proficient at you know knowing how to knowing how to manage your teleport economy is very important as asha mm -hmm. the main thing to understand about asha is that teleport that's your recovery and your offense so you need to man you need to like make risky decisions in order to to actually uh when using teleport or when when neutral with teleport. Yeah, oh F Strong not quite gonna take it. I'm surprised. So I guess Fluffy is like I think it's the widest blast zone I wanna say. Oh that yeah, F Strong about, tried right? to make it. I'll taunt. Oh no, he gets down thrown. The classic uh, taunt to get bodied. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Makes it back on stage, Samian old Oh no! Uh, miss. Yeah, he had his double jump. He could have lived. Oh, <laughs> sad man trying his best to save him. Thank you. <laughs> uh, oh, that's. What a homie. Yeah. Trying to save Asha from SDA. <laughs> Oops. Cool. Did they? Last. <laughs> Last, that's, that's PM, last game I promised. Last game I promised, like... I, I haven't that, seen that, some... That, that means a lot to some people. I've never I don't, seen... I don't think it means that much to me, because I've played so many friendlies in my life. Yeah, but game. I mean, like... He, oh my god! <laughs> that was a... That was a good... Side Ender, off stage. Actually lives, too. That's pretty tough. That's actually kind of a tough recovery. Yeah, you have to, like, do something weird with Dumbbell to, like, halt your momentum. I actually don't know how Dumbbell momentum works at all. It's, uh... I mean, it's, it's, it's hard to explain, but pretty much... Uh... You can kind of, like, control your drift, like, a bit during okay. Dumbbell, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Oh, that, I actually, that... I, I, I can be wrong on that, oh, but no, he texts I feel it. <laughs> like that's happened too much. Yeah, um, I mean, like all I know, notice. like, is, uh, like, you can... <laughs> <laughs> it just goes, <laughs> just rides that momentum. It just go, he just rides straight to his grave. I'm going back to where my people <laughs> need me. <laughs> a sad man yeah. running all over him, making us not look like a... Tough matchup for fish. Mm -hmm. I mean, to be fair, like Asha, that's Asha is like a 
pretty hard character to get right early on. Yeah, it's it's really hard to like. You have to play very safe with Asha in neutral. Because if you get touched, you just, you know, die from oh, neutral teleport. Early in option, I feel like I've seen people go for- Oh no, he teleports right into the f -struck. And the stare. Alright, so 2-0 right, from is, uh, Sad, man. 2-0 for Sad. Alright. Um, let's see. Let's see. Do we have any other sets available? Does not look like it. I, I think everyone else is playing right now. The, that's in bracket, so we'll have to wait a minute. Yeah. So how was your day? Uh, pretty good. I mean, I I just pretty much just uh got up and played some other. Well, <laughs> I. I don't know how it happened, but I'm spectating other fans. We got Walrus. Oh yeah, you, you got that too. <laughs> Walrus versus. How did that happen? Uh, they came in. So you know how like, I mean, like I, within I, a I, lobby you have different yeah, rooms. Yeah, yeah, I, I know how it happened. They, they came in through that room. <laughs> how did they both get in the same room? Like that? That's crazy. Yeah, yeah Walrus. Probably, I mean, it's like auto match more likely than not. Yeah, Walrus, Hammy, Hammy. We dead already. Soros doesn't really enter much. He's pretty good. Like. Oh yeah, for sure. Like, if you've ever talked to Walrus, you would not think he's as good at the game as he is. Walrus is, he's an interesting character. He's also okay. our, our resident uh, modder. Oh yeah? Uh, Rev and Fumblin have finished up. Rev uh, is playing against Bamakio right now. Alright, tell if them you to... want to watch that. Yeah. Rev Flum stream. Alright. Rev versus Lamachio. Flaming Cheeto. So these two played, uh, not last week, at Slapper's Cup 2. Or no, Okay, they're switching? Yeah. Okay. Okay, they're okay. starting fast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, but, um, yeah, the, these, these two, like, have played recently-ish. Flamakio has gotten so good in recent history. Yeah, he's, They've... he's gotten... Real good. Yeah, they have been pushing, you know, I guess their their game plan, their win condition pretty hard. And that's just like, get in with fish and just, you'll find a way to kill. <laughs> that, that feels like what Fumachio does. They, yeah, they don't really... Fumachio, I feel like he goes for a lot of quick kills. Like, mm -hmm. like he tries to end stocks like pretty early compared to a lot of other fish players. Very efficient stocks, I want to say. Like, Famakio will like hit you four times and kill somehow. Whereas a lot of fish, uh, other fish players might like try to do like wave flex conversions or like into edge guards. It feels like Famakio goes for like the very big like killing moves. Yeah. Bit, very early. So like a lot. So like <laughs> most of like most of Famakio's game plan is like built around like DI mix-ups and just like. You know, it kind of chump checks almost on like what, how you have to DI certain things. <laughs> oh, that Man, Fumachio's going crazy. <laughs> Multi oh my god, catches the invincibility out. That's that's such a funny call. Oh, was no. just trying to do a move. <laughs> that is like the wildest call out I could imagine. Oh, that, that's something I, I definitely see every once in a while. It's like pretty funny when it happens. Like official just start mm -hmm. multiplexing between stocks and like. Hope they can yeah. catch you before you throw out a move. Yeah, you kinda, that's you, you kinda have to usually, just respect it. Yeah, you I do have to respect it, but that's like hard to get away with, like if you just like take a pause for a second. Yeah. You know? But still, Rev's just rocking it. Oh my god. They're, they're just playing. That was such a good option. That player, though. Oh, 
the raft. Oh, he lives because of that. Oh my god. Yeah, Rev's trap. And now this is like a frame, a ledge trap, but Rev does kind of drops it. Oh, it doesn't punish the oh. recovery there. The dares. Yeah, Fumachio just no takes. Oh and... wow, mashes out with flex. Oh, that could be huge. No, I wanted to see another near there. Not not a kill, but I that was it... yeah pretty close. I think if Fumachio I th near, I think... he could have done near mm. up B. Oh, that's dead. Side B, that's that is dead. All right, Fumachio, Fumachio taking game one. That was a two star. <laughs> I Did mean, that's kind of... I mean, Rev is, is a really good player, and Flamachio's, like... That that was... That was, <laughs> like, pretty favored, it felt like. Yeah, I was... I think we are going to see the Remedy. Yeah, that, there's, a, there's a character switch to Remedy. Yeah. Well, we see mine, though. I know Rev likes to go no mine sometimes. I, I don't think we'll see mine. I think... I, I I think Revs like feels good enough about like Remedy versus Fish to not really use mine all that much. Yeah, this is a, a pretty tricky matchup for Fish. Fish can definitely win it, but I feel like you have to go for pretty early kills because your kill confirms like they stop working because Remedy is so floaty. Mm -hmm. But the thing about like this matchup specifically is that like Fish either needs to like like, find ways to thread the needle, or just kill Remedy as, as soon as possible without letting Remedy have any setup whatsoever. Oh, barely missing that fair. Would have been a, a great opening stock. Oh, yep, the ledge trap. Still, like, Fish is so big that he gets clipped by a lot of random things that Remedy can do. Yeah. And, and so that's why, you know, like, you really do not want to get ledge chill in this matchup just because pretty much like fish either like has to get back to ledge somehow just to get ledge killed again or you know just dies uh, off of like whatever ledge option yeah uh, or option left remedy has to cover ledge oh my god that's placing the mines yeah that's grab ledge Ooh. yeah that's dead all right Sorry, I mean, it goes without saying, you know, Fish gets punished hard, but Remedy has been, I think, one of the best punish games. She can, she just hits like a truck, especially hitting in the mine like that. Makes this matchup even rougher beside, you know, you know just getting zoned out. Ooh, nice up strong. Oh no. Oh, they trades. Wow. Fumachio keeping it even. Mm hmm. Fumachio's pre pressure right now is, like, really good. Not really giving Rev a lot of room to set up. Yeah. Because, like, Rev has, like, done mines here, like, at this point. So, so I think we're past that point of wondering. But, uh, Rev definitely has the, le the ledge jail in mind when trying to get the Yeah, that's, off stage. that's dead? Yep. Not really much you could do there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, res I, mean, I respect are, the attempt. These are some huge conversions. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Oh, yeah. Catch him going low. Good call out from Camacho. Oh, he's trying to he's trying to get that early. Camacho gonna be able to do here. Ooh, this is bad, but Flex is out. Oh. I mean. Oh. Like, ha Rev off stage, is pr that's probably like the worst spot to be in in this matchup here. Just because yeah. you'd rather, like, if you have, like, mine mid screen, you pretty much don't get to use it without, like, wasting a resource. Fumachu is. Oh my god, the triple power shield! But man, Fumachu is making such big risks. He's. Ooh, that could be dead? No? Not Rev quite. Rev preemptively detonating mine. Yeah, that's dead. Alright, man, but... I really like how Fumachi is playing this matchup. He's 
not afraid of just challenging Rev in the air. Like, on, like in that in that second stock, he was uh, he was just like fishing for the back air. I usually don't see like fish fight with characters in the air that much. I feel like, especially not someone I, like Remedy. I think fish tends to exhale. Uh, exhale. Oh, I keep on saying like Excel. That, but... Excel. <laughs> At the air to ground. Yeah. Just because, like, dare is something that you do have to worry about. It, it It's like, it has its, you know, exploitable, like, spots. But, yeah. like, dare, you will always have to worry about. Same same deal with, like, fair. It does <laughs> exhale through. <laughs> oh, no. I was, Silence. I was, talk I was talking more about how, um, Fumachia was going in the air to challenge Revelo. Of course, yeah. Yeah, which Th that is that is one of those things though that we're like, Fish does kind of have tools to cover space. It's just that, like those tools tend to be kind of risky. Yeah. Oh. Uh, in the air. I mean, like up B, you know that that's straight up. But is that like a like a good idea in this matchup? Yeah. Usually not. Yeah, I think it's. It's always something I've thought about with Fish, is one of his blind spots is directly above him in the air. He isn't, like, you can up be someone, and you can up air, but up air is super slow, it doesn't have much, much vertical range. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I swear, it has a magnet on it. Oh, yep, oh. that killing. Well, Makio kind of just ran in. Yeah. yeah. In order to get that, but like that, yeah, that's that's not really something you want to do, especially because like Rev is very much willing to like preemptively mine and not really even confirm. Just like I am going to cover so and so options by detonating mine here. Yeah, it's it's and, something. And that's probably a good idea. <laughs> it's something I always forget about because it's something you have to learn about fighting Remedy. Is you have to learn how to disrespect. Oh my god! <laughs> Air dodges into laser. Oh just no! Stuck to ledge there. Yeah, Launch is just really he's bad. just running at him now. All right, this okay, is still so doable. Kill. But doable, but it's super hard. Up, first thing. Oh my god! Confirms the F strong F smash combo. Yeah. Jab pressure. Yeah, remedy with a mind. I, I really thought. That uh, like jab jab potion there as shield pressure was actually pretty sick. Yeah, it was pretty crazy. Remedy with a, oh no, Remedy with a with a lead just feels like an impossible mountain to climb. It can be for sure. I mean, I've been de definitely on the receiving end many <laughs> times. I think if any character can do it, though. Oh no, I was gonna say if any character can do it, it's Fish. But that is 2-1. Two, 2-1 one. Two, one for Still, really, that was like a good effort from Flamakio, like, games 1 and 2. The problem was just like, yeah, Flamakio, I think, like, kind of fell apart. Yeah, I think he just kind of, um, yeah. Uh, I think he really just lost his composure game, uh, game 3. I don't know if it was Tilt. But he definitely just abandoned his game plan. Um, they're already they're in. All right. So you're you're spectating this, right? Yes. All right. Um. A husky going remedy. And husky can husky can go whoever he wants. He. He has a good shot of winning. Mm -hmm. Reminiscent of, uh, of Pika. Yeah. Alright. Alright, game one. Uh, Cosmos has been, uh, doing pretty well for himself lately, I think. Was able to beat, uh, Fumbles in a set two weeks ago, I want to say. Yeah. Um, 
I think. Oh, Husky's just dead. Man. I, I'm a big fan of Cosmos' fish, just because I think he plays so differently from any other fish. Oh mm -hmm. I, oh. I've, I've played Cosmos so many times that, you know, I, I will always... I will always, like, consider them, like, probably one of my favorite fish, if not just outright my favorite fish. Currently. Oh! The down air, up air spike, yeah. It's so crazy how that just, like, perfectly sets up into it. Oh, the F strong. I've I've started to change my mind about remedy F strong. I always thought would say tell like newer players like don't use it. It's bad. Um, like it's not very strong. But it's oh my god, Cosmo's almost robbing him. Up being in the wrong. If he upbeat the right way. Oh yep. There it is. Yeah. Uh, the main. The main thing about Remedy's F Smash is that it's not necessarily going to like lead to anything in terms of combo or you know kill, but it is just extra damage if you can confirm into it. And if you have really like, no other option in that moment, why not F, F Smash? Yeah, it's oh, oh almost gets it there. Um, it uh it definitely like covers a lot of options like options really well. Like it covers landings far away from her really well. Like, if someone's trying to, like, oh my god, that's not bad. Husky not going for the last up air. No, he couldn't. And. <laughs> okay, no. Don't die. <laughs> and. Oh, the Nairs. Oh, okay. Three numbers up to eight. That's actually kind of crazy. I know two Nairs hit, but. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember there was a bit on commentary about someone complaining about, uh. The, the big numbers on Remedy don't that count- case, Oh! Yeah, so... It might not look like it, but that's actually a DI mix-up. Uh, the, the FCC up air? That's something, like, that took mm. me forever to realize, is... The, um, the way to DI out of, uh, up air chains, right? To not die off the top, is out. Um, so you, if you FCC up air, the up air facing the other way, uh, if they're holding, like, left, for example, up air to the right, um, then that's just holding straight in, and they'll die up the top. Yeah. It's something not really apparent until you, like, start thinking about it. Yeah, it is definitely it. one of those, like, things that is totally possible, but it, it is, like, kind of weird to conceptualize if you, like, don't really know the properties of Rem's up air, or just FCC in general. Yeah. FCC is such a, a cool tool. It's, uh, it's definitely, like, I think the most interesting part about Remedy. Mm -hmm. I mean, it leads to so many interesting aspects of movement. Yeah, I think, like, I, I really considered, like, just for Remedy having a control scheme where I only have a digital shield press, just so I could do, uh, um, FCC more consistently. Because mm. it, it, oh my god, the down tilts. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, up yeah. doesn't connect, but uh, oh, that he now has oh. their own combo going. Oh no, Text he... on the wall, they are alive. Yeah, Cosmos, that is Cosmos had the right idea of waiting, um, but he just waited a little too long after getting hit with the, the down air. Because that is what you, you do to avoid, like, the up air. Is you fall just below Remy. Oh. The F. Oh my god. The turnaround. That, up that all came from an up smash, pretty much. Yeah. Uh, up, up, up smash on fish dare. That is, like, one of those things that. Uh, oh, they, they might be having connection issues. Yeah. Yeah, I see, I see the, I see the O's at the bottom. Up a bit. But, uh, that is one of those things in this matchup, I think, that Remedy kind of gets that other characters don't, at least not, like, in in such a rewarding way, that up smash on dare. Yeah. Uh, that is, like, such a ridiculously good anti-air for that specific, against that specific Yeah, it, move. it has so many active frames, it, and it's and it's disjointed. It is mm -hmm. so perfectly built for dealing with fish up air. It keeps, it keeps you... Oh my god! <laughs> it's dead at 30! <laughs> Oh my god, uh, it keeps you honest with your landing, so you, 
Because I feel like every fish player... Oh my god! Okay, he died. <laughs> if he made it back... Oh my god. Uh, okay, that I... is... Husky 2-0. Yeah, 2-0 for Husky. I was gonna say, it keeps you honest. Um, a lot of fish players will just down here every single time. Because it's really hard to challenge. Um, like, right. if, you, if you have a disjoint, like, you can deal with it. Like, some good moves of dealing with it are, like, uh, Jenny Fire Axe beats it. Uh, I think Ruby Up, Up Strong will beat it. Remedy Up Strong, obviously, like, as shown there, super good at dealing with it. All right, so now we have Cap versus Fumblin. Yeah. Great. So, God. Cap with the uh, the most ridiculous tag I've ever seen. Still think about it all the time. It's like one of the longest tags I've ever seen. <laughs> Captain Planet with metal arms. Everyone just calls him Cap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is true. One thing, like when I first got into this game, that I didn't really think about, but like, like now I just kind of understand, is that I had no idea that like, when I first watched like a, a lot of Cap sets, because like I started as, you know, I started with BCM and I started like just like wanting to watch footage of that and see what BCM was all about. I just actually thought Cap's name was like CPWMA. And it's like that's weird. <laughs> <laughs> just like the full. That's like a weird name. Yeah. CPWMA. Did I did I get all the letters? That's something I've worried about every time Captain on stream. I worry if I I put in his the the abbreviation right. CPWMA. Oh man, it's I did not expect the Nicktoons announcement to get like not a huge re like boost in slaps popularity again, but like I've seen so many more pe new people play. It. It's crazy. Yeah, it's it's one of those things where like it kind of like indirectly supports this game, which is a good thing. Yeah, everyone everyone trying to get the practice in. So uh, who who you main mm -hmm. in Nicktoon the Nick game? I actually at? don't. I I straight up currently don't know. I I I'll, I will have to try out because this is like yeah, way yeah. more characters in that game than Slap. And the thing about like Ludosity games is that like every character is so unique. <laughs> they, yeah, I, I'm. And I can I'm, just tell that like it'll be the same story for Nick. I'm really looking forward to seeing like a bunch of ideas. Like, I think it's a not to like not to. to like dog on uh, slap at all, but like it has like a lot of unique character designs, but there's not many of them is the thing. And I'm just mm -hmm. I'm just so excited to see what like Ludas does with like I think they said at least 20 characters. Oh my god. <laughs> Cap going for the upbees. I I can I, I love Cap, but the way he plays he does so much stupid stuff. He I I think I mean the the thing about like Cap's neutral is that he he tends to like play like rock paper scissors, but he just like he 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 does he picks like options that are like weird in between just to yeah, like like he'll play he, like keep you like diing like okay so like the stupid stuff like yeah it's it's stupid like a lot of the time uh, uppies but like yeah like it, it keeps people from like being too reliant on like one thing like if they're if you're above cap and you like expect up b like you will kind of need to play around it because it yeah. is a very rewarding up b on hit <laughs> it's, yeah. it's very rewarding if you have fire stuff available yeah, cap is like he plays like a super super good neutral which i think is i don't know maybe you can speak more as a beast em main yourself but i think it's one of bcm's weaker areas because he is like I think he has pretty limited ways to how he can approach. This is one of his big weaknesses. Yes. So the main thing with BCM is that I, I don't think in any matchup like BCM necessarily wants to be the aggressor. You want to eventually get in, but like how you get there 
can be like a matter of like patience or like yeah you have just to be like raw and air you have to be very smart with your approaches which i mean you mm. can do because bcm has some of the best mobility in the game without like any mm. assistance from clutch oh my god <laughs> mm. I, I mean dash dash dance grab is like such yeah. a yeah is, is like such a i guess mediator between things to do yeah cap like, in this matchup that you you will like inevitably like get grabs for for no for no good reason of your own, no fault of your own, you just like yeah, you just lost the rock paper scissors. I mean, Cat makes it look easy to the point where I don't think I think he's convinced himself that ECM's neutral isn't a weak point of it. Like his split, like I, Cap is a big big believer in BCM. I think he's oh my god, the power shield. He's I think he said like he thinks BCM is top three, which. I believe that BCM is top three since like December 2019, <laughs> <laughs> and I still hold on to that. So I, I, I'm with him on that. <laughs> I think most people will disagree with him on that until they play Cap. Cap, Cap really is just is so much better at this character than anyone else. He's so good with like, BCM. Mm -hmm. it, not the. I I realize I haven't said anything about Fumblet. Oh, bad. Yeah. Fire cell on that, but yeah, fum fumbling here. Fumbling, uh, pretty much the inventor of main... remedy. Mm -hmm. I mean, the main game plan here against BCM is that you like, like, do not let him like, yeah. approach, and you can do that in a whole lot of ways. Oh, on a, that's dead. On open air, on open air, this is like kind of a weird matchup because mine doesn't do much. <laughs> I think. Yeah. The Ooh, mine... Down smash. That's a good amount of money. I mean, the best you. I kind of disagree with how she's placed the mine. I think she you want to place it between the platforms, the platform main stage. Um. Mm -hmm. The the problem though is that like then just like B BCM can totally like contest remedy in the air. Maybe not like super high up, but like roughly yeah, like yeah. that platform's height. Like Nair is really effective. Uh, Dare just like sweeping across. You know that that whole platform is super oh, yeah. effective also. So like, remedy kind of has to like, like the risk reward on mine is, is like very much like it's very different from the risk reward on mine that you would get on null or fancy ruins. Right. You have to you have to play a bit differently, and you have to be okay with like missing out on certain options that mine would normally cover on any other stage. Yeah, that's that's very true. I'm I'm kind of thinking about it more. I, I guess I do agree with the mind placement on the stage there, just because, like... This um, is best of three. Oh, yeah, it's best of three. Um... So... Yes. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, th that... The mind placement on, like, that starter stage, like, that that is, like, kind of tough in a matchup like this. Yeah. I mean, Fum Fum one definitely knows better than me about it. One of the <laughs> one of the one of the few people who like plays Remedy so so proficiently. Um, mm -hmm. she's she really she's all she's been the Remedy for as long as she's been playing. Um, big innovator with like FCC. Um, mm -hmm. been at the top level like for so long too. Just recently mm. coming back to Slap, uh, like, maybe a month ago? Yeah, with with the Frawlin in the pocket. Yeah. Uh, she's... <laughs> she's with many, and and has stated she doesn't like how Frawlin is, so... Mm. I don't think we'll see Frawlin in tournament from her. Um, Frawlin, you know, I think everyone will agree is in need of a big rework. But... Oh, up smashes on up smashes. <laughs> I definitely would. Oh my god, that FCC movement was so crazy. So sick. That yeah, jab, jab, mine. Big, big oh, conversion wow. started. That platform combo was actually so, so cool. That little conversion off of like uh, the ground bounce. Uh, th that was pretty clean. Oh, the, <laughs> the yeah. dash back on that. Yeah. To cross them up and grab. That's actually such a oh wild God. decision. Fumblet's just playing so differently this game. Oh, no time from Cap. That yeah, is gonna no time. be kind of significant. 
Oh, oh wow, no dead on that. There it is. Cool. There's something I want to mention about fighting BCM is I think... I, I said it earlier about Remedy, like, Remedy with the lead can feel like a mountain, but BCM is, I think, one of the most momentum-based characters I've ever seen. Like, when he has a lead, he really has a lead. When he's down, mm -hmm. it's really hard for him to come back. So, the, the thing about, like, BCM, I feel, uh, at least, like, previously, like, now I think, like, with, like, losing half of his money yeah, first yeah, off, that, that, I, that's... I, I think that, like, bounces out. But, yeah, like, that... previously, uh... BCM, like, actually could make, like, a lot of comebacks. I've made, like, three stock comebacks in tournament just off of, like, yeah. developing that money. So it's, it's, it, it definitely, like, I, I think his comeback ability is, like, still pretty good, but it's I definitely mean, yeah. a bit harder. Yeah, he definitely, like, with money, like, if you're using it properly, like, you know, you can, oh, but the thing I meant more is, like, he, if you're not making money as much, which, you know, obviously Cap's not. He's making plenty of money, uh... What was I gonna say? You have to be, like... It can be kind of hard, because you're not building up much money uh, when you're behind. You're, like, constantly spending it. And, like, on a last stock situation, you have to be super careful. I'm Ooh. choosing not to sell- OH MY GOD, CAP! Oh, WHAT ARE YOU DOING?! That's, like, the worst possible case, Cap? isn't it? Cap just does yeah. <laughs> That's that that is definitely the worst case scenario for Cap there. They they could have just kept safe. They could just could have kept themselves safe, but no, not I... enough money on that hit. Ugh, that's the... really rough. Yeah, Cap just I don't understand Cap sometimes. <laughs> he's so Some... he's so good. Mm. He's like so good at this character, but then he does stuff like that where it's like I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> I don't know what you're well, doing there, Cap. <laughs> for that all-important game three. Hey, game three. This is uh, probably uh, gonna be a, a bit of, a bit of a grindy one unless they go back to Pepper. Uh, they might. Pepper again. Pepper again. Makes sense. Says one wants Just... to end on a fun stage. <laughs> cap. Cap. Sometimes I wonder how Cap is so good. I question a lot of things about Cap with this game. Like, his decision making sometimes he'll do like, like how he died last game. He'll just do, oh my god, one win with a crazy start. Like, oh, I like that neutral B attempt to get them off the ground. Still, like it dropped, but yeah, yeah that is like one of those things that those little optimizations with neutral B that BCM I think needs to look for, like in the current meta. Yeah. How did he sell out of up B to go back to stage? So, uh, what happens is if you have two hundred dollars, then you can do a, a fire sell out of up B, which is just neutral B again. So you sell two hundred bucks, and then uh, if you hit it. You you know it's it's a very like high hit stun hit. Yeah, it has a, that, a ridiculous uh, amount of hit stun. Much anything. Uh, I died off the bottom to getting hit with fire sale. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I that was I I like I remember the it was the first time I saw it had, like realized how much hit stun it what it had. I was playing Brawlin against Cab, and he just fire sailed, and I died off the bottom at like twenty. <laughs> I was like mm. oh. Uh, famously, it, there's there's the Dume Nene, where you do, at at, at least $500, you do up B into them, uh, hit the up B, fire sale into F strong, and that's a real combo. <laughs> it's, a very, it's a very real combo. Yeah, the... Ooh. It's real important. It's real important for Fumblin to get as much, as much of a, as much percent as she can, as much extra credit. Yeah, because mm -hmm. Cap's gonna have to spend. If she can get this kill, Cap will be not too low on money, but like definitely at a significantly a bad... behind. Still, yeah, significantly yeah. behind. Yeah, like that. A sixty-eight bucks. Uh, if only they round it up. <laughs> uh... Ooh. 
I like the I like oh, the class. To yeah, that's dead. Get out. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, Sandra Kappa version. wanted to uh, side B in order to like get out yeah. of the combo, but ended up just like moving in closer to fumbling. Just like ended up getting like counter hit by I think that was like a fair or whatever. Yeah, that's dead. Oh no, Cap mistimes oh, it. Oh, drops it. Just like very late uh, to get back on ledge with that. Oh air my god! Oh that was kind of god. interesting. Riding oh the wall. Yeah. Oh, oh. That's that would have been damage. so crazy. Yeah, this is this gonna be and, rough uh, for Cap. This is really That's, hard. Cap that cannot be really dead. afford yep. to camp fumbles. Yeah. Ah, there it is. And she takes it uh, 2 1. 2 1. That was like a really close game, too. Cap could have closed it out, but it's like lost her composure a bit at that point. Like, right. ended up like, you know, that that was a very unfortunate way to end game right. two, but um, uh, fumbling looks so game dominant game three. Swear, this is Cosmos, right? Don't swear, Cosmos. Cosmos, yes. Don't swear, Cosmos. Stream. Alright. Mr. Boss Hog. Number one in Europe. Cosmos is playing a, a friendly right now <laughs> with Neck. Uh, I think uh, I've talked about it with like European players, but um, Neck is like the most fish player, like the most stereotypical <laughs> fish player. All Neck wants to do when he boots up Slap City is play fish dittos. He, I see him playing with Fumachio all the time. He's like, he's. He's constantly playing it. I think he's he's definitely complains about like some of the l the less fun matchups as fish. Like he's just such a stereotypical fish main. <laughs> it's it's really funny. Man. All right, I should get the layout as prepared as I can. <laughs> I always forget to do that. I need to really set up a. Uh... What's it called? I forget the site name. But, uh... Scoreboard Assistant. I need to get that set up. I need Ray to teach me. Because I do everything the old-fashioned way. Just updating the layout manually. Alright. So this is... Uh, they're, they're not in just yet. Mm-hmm. So after these uh, losers games, pretty much it's uh, it's gonna be best of five from here on out. Yeah, after this round of losers. So how's chat doing? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Lim Lat. <laughs> I love that typo. Hi, w what's up, Oscar? Alright. I'm sure Cosmos has heard the pings. They just finished up their game. Yeah. Gotta, gotta be gaming in these trying times. Yeah. It's keeping them warm. I, Asuka, I do not play Among Us. I will never play that game. I have avoided it up until now, and I will continue to avoid it. Hop on Among Us. Oh my god. Alright, they're in game. This is gonna be a fish ditto. So yeah, of course. L looking forward to it. These are two very good fish players and they play the ditto a lot. I believe this is Cosmos' like favorite matchup ever. And it's probably Don't Swears too, truthfully. I feel like fish players just love the ditto. <laughs> I mean yeah. It's I think it's, it's for like for like as like difficult of a ditto it is to like be good at. <laughs> <laughs> like, like a lot of them love it. Yeah, it's it's probably the most volatile matchup in the game. Fish, you know, inf you yeah, know, has like a super. He has a super strong combo game. 
Uh, and everything Fish can do, he can do to himself. You will see every single thing possible that Fish has in this matchup. He is a... Uh... I know some people don't like this matchup just because it's like, it's so punish heavy. Mm -hmm. Um... Yeah, but it's just funny enough because like all the fish players love it, but like anyone else, like ah, this is. <laughs> yeah. All right, getting right into it. All right, Cosmos knowing not to try and extend. A little, little fun tidbit. Not so fun tidbit. If oh, the major dare. Oh, nice stall from the fun swear. Um, little fun tidbit is, uh, you can't actually nair fish at zero as fish. Yeah, that happens. Mm. Um, you don't have frame advantage on the Nair at zero. Uh, the other fish can just flex you. Oh, okay. <laughs> don't Man, swear, I... don't swear's combo game, like, is really good. Yeah. They, they have, uh, you know, all, like, the wave flex punishes. And that's really, like, what all, what you need in a matchup like this, is just, like, being able to carry fish across the stage, because doesn't uh, really matter, like, if they get off stage. If they're, like, in an edge guard situation, they probably won't die unless you make a good read. Oh, the Ouija Dare coming out again. So, for those Ooh, who know. Oh, that up tilt. Oh, no. I was, oh, my God. Oh, the, that the, DI was, that was so bad. There's no way I mean, it's gonna be a force. Power shot. shield? There's no way. Yeah, that's dead. Yeah, that's dead. So, Don't Swear is pulling through right now. I mean, Cosmos can just zero to death them three times. Oh, of course, not of course. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, it's about the mental stack. <laughs> What's happening? Oh my god, Doug's for with the stylish ending. The double dare. And that was like a minute 30 game. <laughs> that was like, we were only here for less than two minutes. That was such an explosive game. Oh my god. And this is going to be all ruins. You, you already know. I just have a feeling. <laughs> that was so insane. Alright. Alright, game two. Who's gonna get the first hit? Oh, don't swear! Oh no! What? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say that could have been. I could have been like a kill right there. Kind of like being there. But, yeah, definitely. You know, Cosmos now it. has a bit of an edge guard going on. Oh, nice oh, up. Oh, Uppies through there. Yeah. Okay, miss spacing there. Oh. Yeah, that was. Flashes with dumbbell there. And yeah, I was really lucky for don't swear. That situation can be really bad. Depending on this, where the dumbbell hits, that can just kill you. Mm -hmm. It will go. If it hits the back yeah. of fish, it'll just kill him. So, so the main thing that Cosmos needs to be looking for here is like how Don't Swear is telegraphing their recovery. Because uh, Don't Swear has not been really using a dumbbell to recover as much as, as you as like a fish might normally do. But uh. <laughs> Like, Cosmos, like, like I think the most rewarding situations for Cosmos involve, like, being able to block off space with dumbbells and just, you know, create some offstage chaos like well, that. That's... Yeah, that's dead. That's a kill off the top. That was such good option coverage. Oh, yeah, something... <laughs> like that, a shield on flex. Yeah, so something funny in this matchup, too, is Fizz is the only character that can punish Fish on shield. Mm -hmm. uh, it's it's really funny. Um, like, Fish isn't like plus on shield or anything with any of his aerials, I don't believe. But they're safe enough to where anything you do minus like a roll. Um, like that's the one way to get out of fish pressure. Shield pressure is the roll. Um, can just be flexed. You'll cover it with flex. Uh, but in the fish matchup, in the fish ditto. Ah, uh, Fish can flex himself out of shield. And he's the only character that can do that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's, that's like, the big reason why this matchup's so volatile, in my opinion. Like, outside a combo game, because that's, like, naturally. Yeah. Fish can reversal a lot of his own things. Uh, you know, in, in combo, it's harder, definitely, to, like, land a flex. <laughs> but I still, I love that I mean, down strong. 
Like, a hit on shield for fish isn't necessarily in in the aggressor's favor. Yeah, I don't wanna... I don't wanna say, like, fish ignores, like, shield pressure in other matches, but in this one, he has to be so... In the fish ditto, he has to be so much more conscious compared to other matchups of how he... Uh, uh... How he deals with the opponent shielding. And this is... Like, already to the... Back to the game three. Alright. Oh, DIing onto the platform, good decision. Very nice. <laughs> okay, oh, so wow. what Cosmos could have done is he could have grabbed off of the up air. Uh, I forget who pointed it out to me. I think it was Morris, but he pointed out that Fish up air is so plus on shield, you can actually grab off of it, and it's guaranteed. Yeah. <laughs> I I would have loved to have seen Cosmos show that off. You're like it's. Cosmos likes to land with up air a lot on shield, but he- Cosmos can... is an up air enjoyer, yeah. Well... They, uh... I, I notice, like, you know, like, mid-combo or, you know, other moments, just, like, landing. Uh, Cosmos, uh, does go for that option. Yeah, I mean, I, I really like how they use up air. It's, um... It's definitely, like, a weird timing. I think it manipulates Fish's hurtbox a little bit to where it's, like, s slightly smaller below him on the bottom half of him. So it's actually better at, like, as a landing option than you might think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and in Fish Diddle, like, high percent kind of... It's, it, it really sucks to have your opponent be at high percent because, like... Like, every neutral interaction, like, you might kill, but also that it might just, like, be another edge guard and not I like... really get you as much as you want. Whereas Ooh, if they hit you oh. in neutral, you, like, get full combo and potentially die. Yeah. I guarantee Cosmos was trying to bounce the, the dumbbell off the stage, but messes it up. Yeah. There it's you don't a fully charged dumbbell, but doesn't really get the right angle. Yeah. Or more accurately, like not in the not in a good enough position to actually get anything off that. Whoa. <laughs> F-tilt on shield. I'm not sure about that F-tilt. That's I kinda dead? disagree with that choice. Still, ultra this ultra is an liable. Easy game. Yeah. Oh <laughs> there's the up air on shield again. Oh spot good spot dodge. dodge. Yeah, spot dodge flex. I actually haven't been seeing Cosmo spot dodge as much. It feels like whenever like two weeks ago, spot spot dodge was like a very common option for Cosmos whenever they were uh, getting up from ledge or just like uh, you know doing a tech option. Uh, spot dodge seemed to be uh, just like one of those things that Cosmos had in the rotation to keep you thinking about like what what he's gonna be doing while on defense. Oh my God! Ooh, down smash. The feedies hitbox on up down smash. <laughs> Oh, got a bit of a combo going. Oh, Definitely a big punish okay. on that up B. That was so oh, really? important. Only, only up tilt. Yeah, that was so important for Don't Swear to tack onto the platform there. Could have been huge for Cosmos. Alright. Nice back air. That's... Dead, I think? Yeah. Nope. Oh no! Oh, okay. Just gets them on ledge. Yeah, that's dead. Up smash to kill. Cosmos takes that 2-1, and I think, uh... We are now moving on to Cap versus Fruit. Cap versus Fruit. <laughs> okay, and, and they're already in their own little room, so I'm gonna yeah. go to that. And, uh, be sure that you're in. Yeah, I'm in. I'm in. Alright. Um, player one is and 
and CPWMA. We're good to go. Yeah. Starting Pepper, so, uh, Fruit Jenny is yeah. actually, uh, I, I'm, I mean, obviously it's, it's the character that Fruit, like, knows and plays best, but it is, it, you know, I, I have, like, been seeing a lot of, uh, other characters from, from Fruit. Yeah. Uh, obviously not something that you would play against, like, someone as good as Cap. Yeah. But, uh, Fruit has, uh, beaten Cap before with, with the Jenny. Yeah, so, Cap recently has, he, I got, like, a DM at, I think, like, four in the morning. It was, like, some, I woke up to the DM of Cap saying he found anti-Jenny tech that changes this into BCM's favor. <laughs> I forget exactly what it was, but I remember it was, like, oh, no, that's oh, dead. Whiff's fair. You really... Like, whipping moves, like, offstage with BCM, the only move that I think you can uh, get away with whipping is, like, Dare and Nair. Yeah. But, like, any other move, like, you you actually die. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh! Should've, uh, tried to uh, switch directions there to yeah. be able to kill. Yeah. Yeah. And now, you know, the heavy floaty at 150 makes the Ooh. devil shiver, you know? <laughs> Back throw will kill though. Yeah, so something I've always thought of as like a sore point in this matchup is um, a lot of characters uh, can kind of make Jenny being a, a heavy floaty not necessarily irrelevant, but not as big of a deal because, well, one, she is like pretty poor it, uh, options coming out of disadvantage, and two, she can die really early just because of how how poor her recovery is but mm -hmm. i've always thought bcm can't really exploit the recovery part as hard um i think I th bcm is very capable if uh you know you have like the right position it yeah. is definitely harder to land than on a character like frolin though yeah uh you <laughs> just want to go for like a uh, pretty much dare off stage because jenny you can kind of just bully if they're off stage and, yeah. and they don't really have like the right mix up for it, if they're like a bit just a bit too low, you can um, uh, catch them with it. Yep. Yeah. Uh, one thing I you know Caps like told me about is he likes uh he can BCM can cover Jenny going high pretty well with up strong. Um, like if Jenny's at a certain height when she up bees and she's coming back on stage, BCM can just cover it with up strong, but and going low enough. Uh, BCM can cover with Dare. Uh, like, Cap's been doing a lot of, like, Dare right at the ledge. So, like, the, the Dare hitbox is covering exactly where the ledge is. Um, but I think, uh, he kind of has to cover one or the other. Um. Yeah, you have to be okay with giving up one of those options. Yeah. Okay. Doesn't sell F, bro. Well, it kills. <laughs> Very good money management. <laughs> oh. The skateboard. That could have potentially also been fruit DIing out and just like drifting away. Yeah. So that like the edge guard doesn't happen and Cap doesn't get any more money than already. <laughs> I would be completely willing to believe that. Yeah. <laughs> Either way, uh but a bit of a goof. Ooh, I don't understand why up air there. Um, it's something that's really good in this matchup on, like, a stage like Pepper is Jenny can just dare onto platform very safely. Um, like, it will catch BCM poking his head up. Like, it, it'll hit BCM standing. And pretty Ooh, sure it beats... Fire axe. Yeah, Cap is not respecting the fire axe on between stocks. This timing me up here. Just oh, but this is, you know, I mean, Cap has a very clear shot here. Hey, he's got 200. As long as he doesn't do something dumb with, like, Fire Sail. That's... Ooh. Okay. Not dead again. Yeah. 400 bucks. 
Uh, this is super scary. Oh, that's yeah, terrifying. Back throw. That's terrifying. Oh, oh, tries to F smash there, but the tech oh God, actually messed tech. up the timing. Yeah, that tech was. I could have just dead. Light shields? Oh, breaks out with Nair. Yeah. Um, they could. think Fruit could have just uh, downbeat instead of a Nair. That downbeat's actually faster. Um, at frame 6 versus frame 8. I don't know why Fruit didn't grab there. Oh, that's bad. Oh. That's bad. You're dead? Okay, Cap not killing Fruit off that. Oh, uh, that, that could have been oh. a fair to fair. The up smash takes it. What yeah. a close game. Real close game one. Yeah, and Fruit was not making it easy for Cap there. And we still have, you know, at, at least. Uh, so that must have. Uh... Oh, I think you messed up the score. Oh, yeah, I did. My bad. Fix that. Oh, up air. Way up. <laughs> so many. I mean, that it, that hurts a lot on Pepper. Yeah. It's uh, it's pretty infamous. Uh, for that reason, it's always been. As far as I'm aware, it's been considered a super strong Jenny stage because of the up air conversions. Um, I'm actually of the opinion that I think Ruins is Jenny's best stage. Um, you get the benefit of the low ceiling with the platform, uh, but the platform doesn't interfere as much with side B. Um, in side in this on this stage, you're uh, a lot more limited in how you can side B as Jenny. Because the platforms get in your way. Hmm. So I've always I've been saying that like ruins is better. Just oh my god, they grabbed BCM side B. Oh wow, side B off stage. Not gonna get punished for it, so that's good. Oh, that's oh dead. air dodge is onto ledge. Yeah, air dodge is onto ledge. Cap with the recognition to up smash spike there. Yeah, that's always rough, rough feeling. Nice down B. I'm fearing a little too late. Well, I like the idea with the down B there, but Cap not drifting in for it. Just trying to get out of there. Oh my god. made $50 off that. Oh no. Yeah, that was, uh -oh, a, that was a very nice up B to have. Yeah. Okay. Who has to up B to get out of this? I suppose. Up B. Although I do think like down B would be the more. I guess advantageous, like, escape. Yeah, um, it's actually something I used to, when I first started playing Slap a lot more, it's something I used to spam was just up B out of disadvantage. I don't know why I stopped, because it gives you- It's not necessarily bad. Uh, skateboard having a hitbox actually does mean that you do have to play around it a bit. It it's also- It's just like, it's also, not very advantageous for you. You do have to kind of play the landing game still. Yeah. I think it's against BCM, it might not be as good just because his mobility is so crazy. He can, he can keep up with Jenny's equally insane mobility off of up B. Oh, yep. Oh, no. That looked like... Oh, okay. Ooh, nice oh, fire, fire axe. axe. Had it there for a while. Oh, my God. Again. Another. Oh. Oh, not able to catch landing there. That is like a t kind of a tough one on BCM, just because a uh, side B. Yeah. Uh, just enables you to get out of a lot more stuff. Yeah. On I, top of that, you have like really good landing options. I've always heard there. it called. Uh, I've always heard them say like Tumble Tech's still in the game just on BCM side B. You know it. <laughs> oh, the back throw's just gonna kill. Cap with 400. Back kills 180. Cap could just yeah. steal the stock. He can get something. Oh my god. Oh, tech chase, down tilt. That, if he reads it. Oh my god! Miss tech. <laughs> uh, if he read that tech, that's not, not gonna quite connect. Cap made a bunch of money off that. So yeah, even, even, even if, if you die here, yeah. like you did the best you could, right? Yeah, if you're above. I, I've i always thought, like, if you're above 400 when you die, you can die happy. Mm hmm. 
I mean, still, you have you have so many like ways to kill here. You have F throw like right now. Yep. Yep. And Fair he's, kills. he's got another 200 on tap. Yeah, catches. Uh, fruit landing, trying to like get out with up air by by fairing, and fruit dies for it. But now back to even stocks. Oh wow, very very tense like patient game here. Uh, I think Fruit's cracking a little bit. They're starting to to make some more risky plays. They might be just wanting to seal it all, seal the seal the game. Ooh, yeah, the fire sale. That means Cap doesn't have 200. Yeah, Cap needs to find a way to like convert without killing at this point or uh, get money without uh, killing oh fruit messes up the grab that could have been game oh messes up the down tilt wow there this so is many close tense. calls fruit I, okay, I think fruit's looking for a grab yeah. oh doesn't try to up air there not able oh. to make all the money Cap possibly could. Oh, again, tries for up air. Okay, that that oh, up air's gonna yeah. take it. Kills off the top. Man, that's gotta be a, a huge reliever for fruit. They looked uh, they looked real nervous at the end there. Real desperate for the kill. And Cap is counterpicking Sector, which Sector. I mean, this is definitely. I, th I think so. I mean, Jenny's not gonna kill off the top here. Yeah, He's the not uh... Not as reliably. Jenny's up air conversions definitely aren't as strong on this stage. Um, she has to she has to double jump to get onto the platform, which really hurts, like, getting them up onto the platform uh, with Ooh. up air. I'm noticing that Cap is, like, dropping this confirm, uh, like... Uh, dare neutral B. That is like, I I think like at low percents that pretty much like only works at like missed tech, which I think like everyone at low percent is gonna like try to tech away. Yeah. So Cap does need to like try to like actually tech chase somewhat. Yeah, he's he can sometimes get very lazy with his tech chases. Um. I think it's just a thing with Cap in general is sometimes I feel like he plays just not his best. Like, like there's very clear things he could be doing better. Like, he'll go for goofy stuff. He'll get like, like I said, get lazy with tech chases. Oh my god! Just, oh my god! That's oh, oh my god! Oh, that was so sick. <laughs> that was insane. Skateboard, like the skateboard hit into Dare. That is actually that was so that, crazy. Oh my god, that was Fruit's such a brilliant crazy. punish by Fruit. Oh, I, I wish Fruit went for the Air Strong. Man, Air, air Strong could have killed. The Air Strong actually reaches below ledge. If BCM doesn't like exactly sweet spot the ledge there, the Air Strong hits. It's really, it's a super oh, crazy. Shield. Yeah, though. That Fruit just. Okay, that's Fruit off stage. Oh, yeah, and that's you just, dead. Well, you just held on. Why would you do anything else? Uh, yeah, that's, that's why you don't go low as Jenny. That can just happen. And even game, surprisingly, after that super sick yeah, punish Cap, from Fruit. Cap managing to steal a stock super early, yep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I like that up B. Just up being directly into him. Ooh, yeah, Cap. Ah, uh, Fruit. Ooh. Just trying to get pretty trigger happy on the, the side Bs. Oh, that's dead. Oh, never mind. No. Gets, gets the, the wrong side. It gets the wrong side. So that's, fruit that's dead. Did have a shot there, but now this is two oh. one stock. <laughs> Cap is almost at three hundred. Any like other confirm here, pretty much you're gonna get enough money to, to F smash. Up Ooh. to the I up till F smash on the rising platform. Yeah, the, the sector exclusive combo. That's not a real thing. <laughs> But it's the platform helping out. Ooh, up air. Yeah. Not catching Cap's jump. Oh, wow. 
very like tight spacing game for a second there. Fruit should have uh, fast fell the bear, the bear one in the up till. I think they're just oh, they were a little a little nervous about that hit. Not sure if they were gonna get the hit. Okay, and now Cap has enough to you know oh do any sort of silly thing. No fire cell. That so so oh, much patience there dead. to just up smash. Oh my goodness, I'm so surprised that Cap like just didn't fire cell in that moment. That could have been huge. Yeah. Very Cap. well played by Cap. <laughs> and so now we have, I believe, uh, we're going back to winners. Winners finals, yeah. Husky versus Fumblin. Husky versus Fumblin. All right. Let me get that ready. Okay, they're uh, they're uh, in. Alright. <laughs> the remedy zero. Oh no. I, I doubt this would be a rem ditto. Alright. Oh, who's, who's he gonna go? Asha rem. This is an interesting one, I think. Asha, um, a lot of the tools that Asha has to get in kind of just like, like, Asha kind of just like auto wins neutral in a lot of situations because Rem doesn't really like have like the means to get Asha off without like committing to Nair. Yeah, I um Asha like can get in super easily. The thing the thing about Remedy is she's usually not the aggressor. She usually waits for you to come to her. Um, and oh, has pretty dodge. good oh <laughs> up strong. Yeah, she usually. She's really good at like stuffing approaches, but Aja with you know, big sword, big fair, uh, has a good way of just being able to, I don't know, counter counter her, like just waiting him out. Mm -hmm. uh, Aja just oh, has like dead. a lot of means to get in really efficiently, and not really like the risk reward I think for Aja getting in is so skewed, like towards Aja. It is like pretty hard to like get punished super hard uh, a lot of like remedies combo starters don't really stuff asha you kind of have to pick one or the other yeah oh up airs oh should have done a second teleport there mm -hmm. oh like the mine could have hit i'm pretty sure Oh, not getting the Baja oh, I, Blast. I like the choice. I like the choice of, of the up smash there, because that uh, just gi gives you time to get that second teleport. Yeah. Uh, so that that was actually a, like a pr pretty good decision making. Uh, you know, just like real fast. Like, I, I need this teleport at least. And with, with Remedy being floaty, he, he had more time to like react to what she was going to do on landing and cover it. He just lands with the down throw. That's Whoa, dead. Oh, yeah. You're oh, not no. dead? Um, How's she alive? That was crazy. Uh, some good TI. Yeah, that's dead, though. No? That's not dead. How? She's How not she dying. Alright, that's dead. Oh, okay. Wow. Able what? to survive, though, for a really long time. I think the main thing that I haven't seen Fumblin doing that I think she needs to do uh, like for this next game is a uh, just throw flask. Yeah, I was gonna, I agree with that. I was gonna say too that she's not really pressuring Asha much in neutral. Mm hmm. All right. I I think she needs to uh, be okay with like occasionally losing neutral in order to just throw flask. Yeah. So potential character switch from Fumblin here.
is asking for Husky to pick character. Is it character first in this game? I have no idea. I believe uh, character is second. Okay. I could be wrong. Oh, that was but a I'm pretty sure. It's a, a hotly debated topic, it's... and. <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean, it's like very rarely, like a procedure, is it? <laughs> Ooh, fumbling going. Uh, it'll. Uh. <laughs> I get this choice. Yeah. I I, I fully understand. <laughs> yeah, I was expecting the the caution mirror. Um, so I Yeah, don't... right? I actually, yeah, Fumblin's Idol is kind of rare compared to, like, her Asha, like, in that yeah. time period, like, Smash and Splash, she was okay with playing the, uh, the, the Asha Ditto. Yeah. Um, but one thing I will say, like, having played Fumblin's Idol, it's... I don't want to question your choice, but... Her Idol is very bomb-heavy. She loves to just throw out bomb, and I don't think that's really good against Sasha. Sasha can. Just... I mean, against against Asha, you need to like be doing like up tilts or or nearing in. Uh, sometimes dare just to like stuff out teleports. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, oh, just covering air the air dodge. Here, yep. Reverse it a back air. Mm -hmm. Didn't have butt. Air dodge. Air dodging up smash is one of those things that like you have to do, but it still put, leaves you in a really bad spot. <laughs> the SD. Oh. Looking like flex. Just <laughs> fall into the blast zone. All right. Oh wow, that up B was tricky. Oh. <laughs> threatening, threatening her. Oh, yep. it doesn't turn around. Up oh, yeah, smash. Two, two. Oh, that kill. Jeez. That was so. That was so low to the ground, too. Yeah. And if she was higher up, I get it, but that low? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is... More of this. This is this feels like very rinse-repeat from Husky yeah. right now. Okay, manages to get out of... Oh, no. Or as I say that, back into the blender. Oh, that doesn't trade at all. Yeah, against That's Asha, so you, you have to... You have to make the most out of every opening you get because Asha's advantage state is just the best bar none. Asha will just hit you for like 80% and there's nothing you can do about it. So I'll kind of giving up on that game. Yeah. Understandable that and it'll... Rumbling, she's looking a bit lost right now. I mean, this yeah. is like definitely one of those, one of those things. Yeah, it's... There's the Asha Ditto. She, she she just wants to try it here. I mean I mean it makes sense, right? I mean, e even if she loses this set, she still has a loser's finals. Yeah. Uh, she has said that she she feels that Asha's her second best character right now. Um. Yeah, I would agree with that. Yeah, but I don't know. I know she's a very emotional player, so hopefully she's not on tilt right now. Oh, no yep. teleport? Yeah. That's tough. Yeah. This matchup is surprisingly volatile. Um, just because, I, I don't know why I say surprisingly. I just like, don't expect like, Asha to like, I don't know. Asha can have trouble killing. Is what I wanted to say. So I'd like think like, oh the Asha mirror might be like a lot of a lot of neutral, like get your big opening and then Asha does have good options to get out of disadvantage when they have teleport. No. But the big thing is that like Nair and Up are such good combo tools, like in this ditto. Yeah. You know, they they, they chain into themselves a Ooh, lot. Yep. Nair F strong. Oh, good teleport up to throw off uh, Fumlin's timing. Uh, sh she would have had to delay it, but that's oh, still yeah, like a that's, tough. That's, that's not still better. like a tough teleport to cover. <laughs> what a good recovery! And look at how low on All teleports the like they are just on average, right? <laughs> I mean, they they tend to like be out of teleports. <laughs> Husky just staring them down the shield. I didn't even realize Fumlin's just been. 
and have been forced to use teleports a bunch. Mm hmm Oh, that's dead. Oh. Yeah, wow. that that there is a point where that works. Out. There is a point where that actually is just a true combo. Ooh. Oh wow, covers teleport in with fair. This, yeah. is, this is so difficult Man. to escape. Husky's just got a stranglehold over her. Just catching her whenever she gets whenever she does land, get back on stage, try and reset the neutral. Husky's just ready for it. Gets an opening. Yeah. Yeah, after it takes it off stage. Yeah. And that is a very I mean that's that's definitely a, like a very significant 3-0 there. Yeah. For this for like this whole for I mean that that whole set like felt so dominant from Husky. Yeah. That's uh that's what it's like fighting Asha. It can it can just be so hard because he just is such a strong neutral, strong punish. He's great options to get out of disadvantage with teleport. It can feel like mm -hmm. just a wall fighting Asha. You, right. I just I don't know. I don't think Fumblin fights Asha a lot, so she might just not she it the one thing is she didn't really have very strong punishes on him. Um she might not be used to like punishing Asha. Um, because he's the fastest baller in the game. Um, so you have to time your combos a bit differently. You have to do the things a bit earlier, so she might not have been used to that. Um, maybe she can, you know, uh, assuming she wins losers finals, uh, warm up against, like, Asha in some way. Like, practice combos against her. Um... Mm -hmm. Just to get, just to get ready, used to the falling speed, because you have to get, you have to make the most out of every single chance, every single opening you get off Asha. It's so. Now we have a loser semis, which is Cosmos versus Cap. This is like what I'm, like pretty excited to see, because I think uh, Cosmos like knows like this BCM matchup really well. Uh, we used to play together a lot and uh, like when I was playing well like it was like pretty even so and I do think like Cosmos ha has what it takes to like consistently beat Cap. it's just a case of like having to play a bit more different than you might in like the fish ditto or just a any other matchup really you do have to play pretty different yeah all right, and uh, okay. So there are just uh, just waiting, waiting for to get in. <laughs> waiting for Cosmos to stop playing Nick. All right, they're in, and they're gonna start ruins. All right, got there in just the nick of time. All right, all right. So, BCM fish. Yeah. So the main thing BCM is going to be looking for here is like ways to deal with fishes landing. So uh, you know, a lot of like fishes will like to land with like dare or uh, you know, like like drop down air stuff like that. That is a uh, BCM has ways to cover that. It's just that uh, it's you still need you can still miss it sometimes just like as a matter of timing. Oh my! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, that F smash! <laughs> the, the stare into the camera. Powerful start by Cosmo. <laughs> yeah. Oh no! Flex out of shield. Good patience. Okay, spot dodging. This is one of those things that Cosmos does that I think is like kind of anti BCM. Honestly, it is a uh, just spot dodging on wake up. Oh, he wanted to uh, get the bounce off the flat. 
Cap consistently likes to do like side B tech chase or like like picking those sorts of ledge options, but Cosmos is okay with spot dodging sometimes just to like keep Cap's options honest. I hate Cap. I hate that Cap does that air strong. He gets away with it so much. Oh, choosing not oh. to sell. No F throw. Oh, <laughs> doesn't well, there you go. It's clipping him with the dare. Light yeah. shield. Oh, what that hits? All right. I. Oh, what is? I, I don't what know. Is I don't know what's happening with the uh, Cosmos' upbees here. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Cosmos is known for like doing the up ledge cancels. Like they'll just up B, and then they'll just ledge cancel it, and they'll keep doing it. It's it's really hard to cover, but don't know if that's what he intended there. <laughs> no, God, that that feels so bad to do every single time. Hit the the BCM down B. <laughs> it's it's one of the I think BCM down B. Oh no. Ooh, okay. And Cap like now in a really good spot to make oh. something happen. You're not dead here, but you do have to spend money in order to keep yourself alive. Oh. I, I, yeah, I don't know if you could have, like, timed Ooh. up smash any better there. Covered there. Uh, <laughs> Recognizing Cap was gonna... <laughs> Whoa. Okay, so, like, that... That's one of those spots where, like, Cosmos did actually get grabbed yeah. by side B. But, uh, just as he got hit, you know, it happened. So, like, they get released. That is, uh, pretty wild. Kind of rare. Oh, yeah, that's dead. Like, Cosmos is doing a really good job of just... Uh, mixing up their tech options. <laughs> that move is just so demoralizing. No matter what happens with it, it's the more it. I hate it. <laughs> like, like it's 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 got surprisingly low. It's like surprisingly hard to punish. Um. Mm -hmm. So you'll feel like oh. a you'll feel dumb. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I don't know what, if fire sale was. Oh the no, best jab there at all. Wow. That's Not dead. Even Ow. You're not dead, but uh, you are like now at a pretty high percent without a lot of money. You can, you know, all it takes at this point is one neutral B to really be at, at just That's... like the right amount. Oh, weak hit. Oh, that's dead. Oh, yeah. Yeah, catches cap overextending. Mm -hmm. Cosmos takes game one. And this is best of five. So, we will see at least two more of these. And, uh... Yeah, Cap here, I mean, I think the game plan is pretty solid. It's just, a. Uh, it's just a case of being able to catch Cosmos' landings more consistently and uh, being able to read sort of like those spot dodges. So, open air. This, <laughs> that is, uh, this is an interesting stage. Uh, pretty much like every platform stage, uh, you know, with fish on screen, uh, leads to fish getting sharked pretty easily. Yeah. Uh, and also just like, you know, Dare on, on plat here is, is really strong, but it's still like pretty wide, so Fish does have like ways to smack you if you're on, on this platform. Oh, yep, that's it. Good fair sell. Yeah, great first stock from Cap. <laughs> oh my god, that up air. There's some, some lag happening. Yeah, that, that is a bit of unfortunate connection. Oh, good <laughs> shield, but like you're oh. still. Cosmos was an advantage like that whole time. It felt like no double fair. Oh, missed the double jump. Missed yeah, the double that's jump to get dead. Double fair. Cosmos still dies. Yeah, not a great trade. <laughs> Can't call it a GameStop trade anymore after you know. Game stock stocks blowing up. I don't know what to call it anymore. Right. 
Oh wow, catches flex with jab. That is a uh, pretty rough for Cosmos. Uh, I mean, if you like get comboed after flex, that that hurts a lot, honestly. Oh, that was a great up B call out. The cap's just been stuffing out Cosmos this game. Like he's just been, I don't know, like staying just out of Fish's range and just hitting him with like up airs and the like edge of Nair's hitbox. Oh, he wanted that. He wanted Ooh. the reverse hit. Okay, fair. DI's out on it. Fairly missing that fair. Yeah, that's not great. I'm surprised that down tilt connected, honestly. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. The up into it. Yeah, it cancels the up. Oh, my. That was so weird looking. He, like. Yeah. No! He upbeat too slow. If he upbeat earlier. For sure, what oh, it's nice to bear, but I think Cosmos is too used to that. Just able to uh, tech in, tech roll in to be able to, uh, you know, get out. <laughs> oh, 199! That, that bear covered a lot of options, but it's like Cosmos just picked the one that where bear didn't cover it. I want to point out Cosmos could have been dead if Cap had one more dollar. <laughs> oh. Not gonna yeah, catch not, that. not spending it. You, you can't spend it here. Yeah. <laughs> Falling up air, <laughs> up smash. Yeah, falling, falling up air just does everything. Yeah, it's in those it's, situations. It's like this is one of those matchups where falling up air is actually pretty useful just because of how big fish is. A lot of other matchups, like you know, most characters aren't tall enough or like they're not in the air often enough. But uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, on that stage and that like spot like right next to flat you definitely try falling up there just because like after that like the up smash is so free and i uh, kept banning null and meadow oh, meadow <laughs> yeah. okay they're going back to open air i think you would probably rather take actually Hmm. That is kind of tough if you if you really don't want to play Pepper in this matchup. Yeah. Al although I do think like like Pepper is like preferable here. <laughs> Cosmos just fishing for these stairs. Yeah, up tilt. Oh. Oh, doesn't try for another uh, up tilt. I could have kept that going. Fire cell. That was like the fastest fire cell on hit <laughs> yeah, I've ever I, seen. I was gonna say that. Was Instant, he was ready. Oh my god! Was that god. Cher? Oh, that <laughs> was that Cher Fire Cell? Because if so, that's kind of insane, actually. Yeah, it was Cher Fire Cell. That was like the old, like, Cher Fire Cell when you- when it wasn't like a pseudo-counter. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he sweet spotted that. Choosing to go for Nair instead of another fair. Maybe the fair wouldn't have connected? <laughs> uh oh. Okay. You don't want to trade with that. Yeah. That's that's a really bad habit of caps, but I get I guess I can't say it's too bad because he usually doesn't go punish for it. But Cap will always up me into you when he has fire sale. Nine times out of ten, he's going to do it. And I think a lot of people let him get away with it. But even if he does get away with it, he's just wasting $200 a lot of times. Yeah. I mean, the, the thing about it, though, is that, like, if you think about, like, the reward that you get on hit, like, that that's pretty... I mean, it's, like, kind of incredible, like, the amount of hits done that, that you get off of this. I mean, that it's that's true, but I think the problem is he does it all the time, and it's very obvious when he's going for it. I think the reason... Um, a lot of people don't punish him for it, or get hit by it, is because they don't realize Cap has like 200 and he's going for it. Oh wow, I'm surprised that Air Dodge actually made it back to stage. That, oh yeah, that was oh, so low. The down B not coming out Oh, no out combo is out for the Air Smash. I was just looking for a way to, yep. No! I'm surprised he didn't do, uh, up, up strong. 
Oh, he's wow, doing no the he's here. doing the edge cancels. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> he's just up here. <laughs> oh, he snuck around that day here. That was so crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> Why? Cap waking out the flex. Oh, that's huge! Alright, suddenly, Cap is has a serious chance of winning this. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Don't do it twice! Oh, yeah. Oh no. Alright, doesn't get clipped by F Smash, but. Oh, Cap's out of I money! Mean, you have no money. Where'd, he, where'd all of his money go? Oh, good, just like not trying to drift in. Would have gotten so blown up that's, there. That's. Oh, no tech yeah, on Grant Dumbbell, Ledge. you're dead. <laughs> yep. Alright. I don't think he could have teched it. I think he was on the ground. Team 3 going to Cosmos. Mm, okay, so they're uh, both thinking that it's kind of laggy. Which, yeah. yeah we, we, we saw a bit of like, the, that stutteriness, that choppiness, uh, like in that last game. So they're uh, not sure if they're calling a connection test right now, but. Yeah, Cap is uh, asking are... for one. Yeah. Uh, Cosmos saying he's fine either way. It's Cap's call. They're gonna, gonna power through it. <laughs> I don't know why, Nick. <laughs> it's the classic. It's the bonkage. Yeah, <laughs> you already know it, bro. <laughs> Many thanks, Ned. <laughs> oh, they're going to Fluffy. This has always been one of the weirdest things about Cosmos and Fish to me. Is I know I'm not alone in thinking this, but I've always thought this is an awkward stage for Fish. But Cosmos loves oh. this stage. I don't I, think Cosmos loves this. I think he's just like played this like against me like so many times. Oh my god, that happened again with the side beak like trade. I can't believe that happened like twice in one set. Stutters. Mm -hmm. They they are just playing this out, which th that makes sense. I mean, they're this far. They're pretty this far, like, in. far into the set. Um. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Oh, <laughs> that have strong. Keeping it up with jab down tilts. Keep it simple. Whoa, I'm surprised Cap just, like, avoided everything there. <laughs> that F-Tilt. Yeah, something I've noticed Cosmos is doing a lot more is, like, the aerial side B approaches. He started doing that last game, and oh no. Oh, you hate to see that. Drops the confirm to the lag. <laughs> oh yeah, it's, it's pretty rough this game. Oh. oh yeah. I, I'm I'm willing to believe that this is probably on Cosmos' end because I'm noticing yeah, Cosmos the cap, is like, ping. pretty steady Cosmos like is, 80, yeah, Cosmos 80 is. ping, but Cosmos is like spiking up like past 200 ping. Yeah. Looks like they might be doing something. <laughs> yeah, Cap's like typing right now. Yeah.
but yeah, it, it, if this like does like come down to connection test, then this would probably rule in Cap's favor. Yeah. Hate to see it end like that, but oh, that was super good going under the stage to avoid the diamond strong. Oh my god. Yeah, the side be saving Cap. You can't miss that without like a good angle. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, you would need to like be like the a, the a tiny bit more vertical there, but like I saw Cap's angle there and, and I knew that, that wouldn't you wouldn't live off that. Yeah. <laughs> oh my ah. god. <laughs> Yeah, he's down just dead. Deep. And the downstroke. Down the downstroke for good measure. Oh. This is... Oh. Okay. One thing about like fish like on top of plat here is that uh, dare just does hit. It just does. <laughs> yeah, it's a. Oh, the F stroke gonna take it. And oh. Cosmos. Uh, Takes that set 3-1. Unfortunate that I had to like fall into connection problems. Yeah. But uh yeah, it looks like uh Cosmos does uh does just plan to uh you know move on to the losers finals here against Fumblin. Alright. So this is a set that we've seen recently and I'm really excited to see this run back. I think this like Cosmos was able to take an upset over Fumblin, and that was like pretty huge in itself. But if this happens a second time, that, you know that speaks a lot about like how how well Cosmos has been playing recently. Yeah, for sure. All right, leaning. Um, Losers. Finals. All right. Stay hydrated, gamers. <laughs> okay, they're uh, getting in. I think they're searching each other. Uh, Challenge me by accident. Oh no. Not this. His lobby broke. Lobby broke. I think Cosmos has to stop searching. I think that'll fix it. Uh, yeah, they're in. They're in there. Alright, they're in. Oh. Cosmos versus Cosmos. All right, ruin start. Uh, fish versus remedy. I think that like what we're going to be seeing in this matchup is kind of just like the return that that a uh, Cosmos' fish does uh, gets like just on any good hit. Uh, Cosmos, I feel like is especially 
like good at like covering remedy in the air. Oh yeah. He's like willing to he's like willing to do the up B that, that kills. E even if it's like not always the best decision. But uh you know, Fumblin, oh, she will I mean she is very tap. good at like these these air mix ups and just like the Dropping movement in frames. the air. Yeah, I'm dropping a bunch of frames apparently. Oh yeah. Let me see what I can do about that. Uh, where is? Oh, there's the ledge jail. Uh, mine on on ledge is very scary for fish to deal with. It's so big. Oh my goodness. Okay, you're you're dead there, but you still like are okay with that trade. You're a stock up right now. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Oh, wow. Just keeping that combo going forever. That's massive damage. Alright. Gets hit by laser and dies for it. Very even games. I think you're... Oh, actually, never mind. I thought for a second that, like, the frame drop stopped just by looking at the screen. Yeah, it's... I'm... Alright, let me mess with this a bit. Trying to lower the frame a uh, bit rate. Ooh, down dude. Okay, even stocks still. Uh, Bumblin has a lot of things. Uh, going her way here. Uh, mainly with mine out now, you can just convert it from anything here. Oh, not even gonna mine, just like keeps it out and just combos more. Are you dead? Oh my god, that down smash! I, I can't believe that down smash actually. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna research real quick. I'm just gonna flick it on okay. and off to fix the bit rate. Um. All right, where are you? Let's go. All right. All right. So, uh, sorry about that stream. I just forty-seven viewers. What? Oh wow! Let me know. Crazy. Thank you to everyone tuning in. All right. So now we have a. Uh, oh, also, Cosmos at one game one. Okay, okay, yeah, I missed that while I was uh, trying to fix stream issues, thank you. Uh... Okay. Alright. Yeah. Alright, so... Pepper, um... <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea about anything stage matchup-wise, so I don't know if this... I mean, I can understand this the is... This is good for Remedy. It yeah. goes off the top a lot. Uh, you will have to like play around like your own floatiness a bit, but like you'd rather like yeah. like get the early kills because it doesn't really matter. Fish is gonna die in a lot of different ways. That's it's dead. Just, like, <laughs> how soon do you get there, right? Yeah. Right there, you can see that she is making very good use of these very low blast zones. Oh, trait in there. I don't know. On top of that, did. mine in the center does a lot for Remedy. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh, tries to just beat out the uh, down strong, but not gonna work out. Yeah, the DIing against Fish Bear there is so scary. Oh, that hits through the stage. Oh yeah, the, da the dare does. I like the oh, idea with the mine. Uh, but I think they, they detonated it a little too early. 
me up. Barely out, out of reach of that bear. Oh no! Ooh, doesn't try to get the stage, just tries to drift back, but... Yeah, that's Humbling, it. She is patient as far as just like grabbing ledge, staying there. I'm gonna wait until fish drops all the way down to the blast zone. <laughs> I think oh, that spot though just so scary. Uh, uh, Cosmos is just not afraid of mine right now. It's like, oh, yep, that's dead. Very nice lead right now for Cosmos, but still, you know, on a stage like Pepper, it's bound to be a little more volatile. Oh, still though. Oh, oh misses the downbeat. Oh, misses. Oh, gets the hit. sour spot. I could be dead? I like, uh, yeah, just it. grab ledge. Oh, but just grabs on. Yeah. Oh no, the lazy, the lazy Ooh. coming out at disadvantage. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, just... Yeah, okay. Alright, you make it to the other side. I wasn't sure if she was going to be able to. Ooh, that that was such a that was such a death-defying recovery right there. Oh, oh my yeah. goodness. Oh. You're not okay. dead? Oh, oh no. Mine that, is on its way. Oh my god, great DI Doesn't for connect. Cosmos. Oh, You're that, not dead. This is so tense. That... Oh, that, uh, that flex was so good. The offstage play. Oh, she kept her double jump. Oh my goodness, that didn't like... Oh, that's... Okay, that could have been real like, bad. Any knockback. <laughs> oh, oh, you got hit by that. Okay. Of all things. <laughs> dare into up tilt to kill. <laughs> that was up 2-0. Wow. That was such a tense ending. See. Strong start from Bumblin. Oh, tr unfortunate trade for the fair. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Yeah, that's oh, it. Okay. That's I the mind I kill that you want. I love the little wait there on the after the fair. This little pause. The fall into the mine. I'm just Ooh, setting wow. up a wall, but let's have to trade with that flask in order to like get any real like pressure started. But good DI now out it's looking there. pretty rough for Cosmos. Yeah, Fumlin's playing a lot more confident this game. Mm -hmm. Like they're go they're they're being more aggressive in their punishes. They're Trying to get more opening, trying to be the aggressor in more situations. <laughs> oh, that's so it just sad. Falls. Yeah, a little too much drift there. Yep. Oh, nice flex to delay themselves. Ooh, we yeah. compared to upbeat. That that was kind of nice. Yeah. yeah. Pushing, pushing Cosmos to corner, but. Not able to get much off it. Not dead. Oh no! <laughs> right as I was gonna say, not dead from that. Oh, she tried wow, to. Wow, even up right again. <laughs> she tried to air dodge that... into the, the, the dumbbell. That oh. must be a huge hit on her composure here. Oh. I right. mean, it's like you, you've been working this whole game for like such a nice lead and it's gone away in pretty that's, much like 20 dead. seconds. Uh, FCC to mix it up? Alright. Let's see what Pumlin can do to try and continue their lead, make it stronger. I thought she was gonna up here for sure. Oh, Flash. I could be dead. Yep. <laughs> yeah, FCC <laughs> up here as the DI makes up yet again. It's so hard to see coming. You have to be super aware of it. This happens in an instant. Alright, and so now, if 
Newfoundland is on the board for this. For the set that has been looking so much in Cosmos' favor up until now. And I, I totally believe that the reverse 3-0 like, can happen here. Yeah, she's got a bit of momentum now. Trulia found, found an answer in uh, between games. She's looking a lot different than the first two. Where are they going? Going to gym. They're going to open air. This is a really good pick for Cosmos here. And that's kind of like the, the hard part, I think, is like the stage picks are going to be so much more difficult to like get that reverse 3-0 that she's looking for here. Good. Setting up a... Setting up her... Zoning. Oh, barely, but Cosmos covers yeah. it. I mean, that dumbbell is terrifying to anyone. I think. Yeah, that was such so. good. That was such good option coverage on Cosmos' part. Someone looked like she made it through, but cover what she did after. Oh, good tech chase on platform. <laughs> that, that oh, weaving out of there with the FCC, the FCC. It was just blast clutch. Just FC. Ooh, up tilt to anti-air. Ooh. You're not like dead. But like, wow, that that's so much damage. <laughs> okay. That hair's strong. Oh, bait's mine also. Ooh, that... Alright, good up air to get out of there. I'm just gonna say that could be death. Not getting a knife from that. Does he up be here? Ooh, covers no. the air dodge. Just the up tilt. <laughs> what was <laughs> that trade? <laughs> that was just side B. <laughs> Rare you see someone actually just let it rip with the side B, but worked out pretty well. Ooh. I think if he angled that better, could have maybe hit Fumblin there. Ooh, I'll throw up strong, that's up it. Smash. Yep. <laughs> oh, misses uh, the ground bounce there. Not able to like get a full combo oh. still. Fumbles. That's stuck. rough. Destroyed. And this is like such a hard position for her to come back from, right? I mean, this is. I'm especially like on, on a stage like this, like like now you like don't have mine anymore, and you're off stage, and you're potentially dead here. Cosmos, Cosmos is a uh, combo. You guys really good right now. The openings uh, from what's able to get just aren't as strong as she'd like them to be. Oh, the chain grab! <laughs> oh, wow. All right. Cosmo's mashing up air. Oh, this could be big. No jump. Oh, misses Flexes the out. up air. Uh oh. All right, barely avoids that down B. Oh, that's huge! Oh, but she doesn't kill! Alright. Oh. This is super scary for Fumblin. Does Cosmos get, like, this oh, second set dead. against Fumbles? Oh, oh my goodness. 3-1. That's 3-1. That's Cosmos takes, takes it against Fumblin for a second time at this point. Oh my goodness, Cosmos! Cosmos's run tonight uh, th is kind of insane. I mean, able to like beat Don't Swear in a pretty close game, uh, took fruit pretty convincingly, and now you know able to beat Fumbling again in the in their set. So we got it. Grand so five. now this is yeah, this is Grants.
I, th I, th I think they're just gonna go all ruins. This is. I'm hoping for a fish ditto, but like, Husky went a I'm, little I'm last a time. I'm a big fan of Husky's fish. I think the way he moves is so so clean. Okay, hey. I, Husky's uh, gonna take a little bit of like a minute to be able to get started on this game, but then we should be getting a great grand finals. All right, they're in. Alright, it looks like we're going to be sitting there. Uh, they're, they're uh, doing something real quick, so they're just going to... Yeah, yeah, I saw Uh, it. yeah. You can say they're peeing, it's fine. Nah. It's a little gross. <laughs> Why would I say that? L happening with Summit. Have you been watching Summit? Summit? Yeah. Uh, not a lot. Yeah, I haven't watched as much as I'd like to. Oh, they did a... Uh... They did a, a skit earlier, like I managed to see, uh, about like uh, rotation etiquette, right? Like, mm -hmm. like friendly setup etiquette, and they brought up the bane of my existence at locals <laughs> for years. Is you're on a three-person setup, right? And a fourth person comes on, and they ask, "Want to play doubles?" I hate, <laughs> I hate that. If you do that. I hate you. I hate you. I don't want to play doubles with you, random person. Just wait your turn in line. Please. Please. I don't want to play doubles with a random person. Alright, so we are... This is Grand Finals. This Husky is going to be rocking the idol. And Cosmos, of course, you, you have to go fish. This is potentially going to be all ruins. So we already know... Oh, like, that's dead! Be very early... Let's hug. A lot of use of Fire Wand right now from Husky. That's a, an interesting one. I mean, it slows fish down from side B, but, you know, it, it is kind of a, kind of like a vulnerable move, though. It leaves you open for, for a while. Yeah, if you're using it from a distance, it's, it's pretty good at just being able to, like, see what they're going to do. Yeah, like yeah I mean, like, there, like, it, it's so, so much easier to, like, telegraph that, like, short hop nair or whatever is about to come out. The way I've started thinking about fully charged fire wands, it's kind of a get out of jail 3 card, uh, from like, for approaches. If you catch them with like the fully charged fire wand, um, you're going to be safe after, generally. Oh, nice nair to, uh, that's strong. Um, but yeah, like, you don't get a whole lot about out of it, but it kind of resets the situation. Oh, oh my god. god, that tech chasing was amazing. Co good wall tech from Cosmos. <laughs> oh no, oh, oh my I like the I, I like the idea of, of strong but husky not fighting. So, yeah. so someone in chat asking about it, yes. So uh, whenever you see a character like turn around during like any special moves, that's a uh, them using clutch in order to reverse their momentum. Yeah, it's important to it, note... It is kind of like a wave bounce, but yeah, it, it's it, it does function differently. It's important to note that it completely reverses your momentum. 
Um, so if you're flying one way and you clutch a move, you will fly in the opposite direction. It's a very huge part of Slap. It's one of the most unique thing of, things about it. Uh, something in, tan in tandem with uh, that is the fact that your airspeed is actually completely untapped. Um, so if you're gaining momentum and you clutch, you will keep gaining. You will go in the opposite direction and keep gaining momentum. Let you see some crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, fish isn't too big on clutch recovery, but you'll definitely see it with Idle. She'll either do Fire Wand, or Fire Mace, sorry, or uh, Butt Clutch back to stage. Oh my god, oh my Husky! God, these F smashes are brutal. <laughs> Man, these, the platform has just been Husky's best friend of this set so far. It's just there when he needs it most. Oh wow, not able to cover landing with up tilt. Just goes the wrong way. This is... Oh, he's a huge combo for it too. Oh, misses the fish killer. Just like barely. It hits the weak spot up there. <laughs> Hitting up him smash with the kills? Alright. I hit him with the back hit. I'm surprised it connected. I've Just... never seen that back hit like work before. <laughs> I've, seen I've it like times. never oh, I've yeah, seen it a few it's... times, but I've like never seen that like it, like in tournament. Oh my god, <laughs> that would have been crazy. Yeah, Husky. Not able to get anything off that. Yeah, the tech chasing. Husky's so good at just react to tech mm. chasing with it all. I mean that that's that's the thing, right? Is that like I the most important thing like in punish game I think is like tech chasing and just like sharking, just being able to like catch recoveries or catch landings, because like every, every character has like you know like a true hit like two hit combo. Uh, yeah, that's, that, that's dead. true. But uh, you know how do you keep that going? How do you keep that ex extending, extending those? types of conversions and that's like Husky Husky's tech chasing with Idle is very efficient. It feels like he covers like so many different options. Yeah, I think it's the big thing that separates him from other Idles is that he's so good at that tech chase. It lets him get a lot more extra damage and openings um from it. Oh no. Oh wow. Fast falling with a bear. Down. Husky's up 2-0. This could be over this next game. Alright. Is Cosmos maybe gonna try it? No. Yeah. <laughs> He's going back yeah. to ruins. Ruins again! Ruins again! All ruins! I respect it. I mean, these two are ruins mains, so... Yeah, I mean... I always say, if you don't... If I don't trust people who don't like ruins. It's, uh, it's, it's a part of my region's culture. Is, uh, the Smashville-like stages. Disrespect ruins, you disrespect me. You disrespect my people. That up till connected, that was <laughs> yeah, disgusting. that's crazy. Oh my god, the tomahawk! Ugh, gets oh. hit by dumbbell. I don't think that dumbbell really hurt Rusky at all. Not really. If anything, it put them in a like the yeah, position a better, to let a better, Yeah, better position. Yep, that's gonna work. Oh. Okay, Cosmos is on the board first, so that is, you know, very good prospect here to be able to get an, a little bit of an early lead and hopefully get that extra credit here. Oh wow, Cosmos going so low to be able to just recover. Oh yeah. Ooh, okay. I mean, you take that damage probably. Yeah, I mean, you take what you get. Yeah, and Ill's jab is it's so good. Oh, he's just Ooh. dead from that. I thought he had his jump. That's crazy. Apparently no, not. no, no jump. I wasn't able to already use their dumbbell for recovery. <laughs> this combo. Again, oh it, it's like that tech chase. Just being able to oh, convert I, off of that is I so huge. I love that bomb setup. I've never seen something like it placed it right on the that. ground like that. Yeah. It's not over for Cosmos. Yep, the fish killer. Oh my goodness. Potentially this is so tournament brutal. stock. 
<laughs> yeah, I love how I love how Husky will throw bomb like and recover with it. Ooh, grabs bear. <laughs> Who <laughs> does that? Husky, that too. Husky is insane. Oh, I like the I I think. Oh yeah, that's a there it is. Commanding 3-0 from Husky. I mean, congratulations to former Owen Tour last week, Husky, for managing to level up so hard that he won the turn. What improvement? <laughs> Crazy. But yeah, that is the that is the tournament. So congrats to Husky. All right. Thug finals. Wow, what a showing from from Husky. You know, I think last week it was just a, uh, just an O and tour. Episode tour. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I just I just grinded you know, you and I got put some hours in. in. <laughs> I, I put I put the hours in, put the work in, practiced the matchups, and I'm here today. So thank you. Rise guys. and grind, gamer. Right. That's right. That's right. All right. Let me let me update the overlay. Theory finals. Great. And right. I'm gonna capitalize your name, but I'm gonna make the important distinction each is lowercase. Uh, no! <laughs> Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> it's lowercase h, you've said. I... I... <laughs> Why? You know my branding is entirely consistent on everything. There's not a single platform I'm on that the h is not uh, lowercase. And yet you do this to me. <laughs> it, it hurts, Malk. It hurts. <laughs> right. Let's see, uh... Oh, I've, been, I've been playing bunch of Italy recently. Italy. It was a lot of fun. It was fun. It was very, very fun. Alright. That's why I play them. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, so... <laughs> yeah, one thing that I noticed that your little does, like, especially well is, like, that sort of tech chase, like, off of dare, pretty much. Right. That's awesome. Like, I feel like most Italy's... Yeah. Most idols, I feel like oh, they they great. either just like cover like the the ground bounce and then that's just kind of the end of it. But you actually like like cover options beyond that. Yeah, uh, I think it's so strong. I, I think mm. idol has some of the best punch game on basically like <laughs> like all the characters, <laughs> even floating. Uh, just because the tech chase exists, you can do that to literally everyone. You can do that to remedy. You know, that works on every character. It's ridiculous. Honestly. Ow. <laughs> Alright, my hands are cold, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> ow, ow. Yeah, uh, PSA to all idols. Tech chase with up throw, up air, down air. Or just up tilt, you up air, him. down air. <laughs> oh, nice. It really is broken though. It's it's just if you can react, like if you have good reaction time, uh, and you can and you know how to cover some of the options, uh, then just just do it. Honestly, it is so much better than trying to go for some dumb combo than trying to achieve them. All right, all right. From land. <laughs> Listen, she's my second best character. I hate it. I'm only I'm only good at the, the easy characters. <laughs> For Lon and Jenny, uh, it's main. very difficult to fair and then fair again. All right, yeah, it's <laughs> and then hard. Fair again into a bullet downer. I mean, it's hard. Listen, it's you gotta you gotta space the bullet you gotta space Right, you gotta space the downer. Maybe, <laughs> maybe even go for a fastball air strong after it. So you know that. Now that's difficult. Oh, oh, oh tantrum. Oh. Uh. Fucking really. <laughs> Goodbye. Damn. Yeah. Ron just gets bullied. <laughs> she, it's very funny. It's it's literally like, oh, she's like this horrifying menace on stage, then off stage is like, oh, okay, you can just do the thing. On yeah. Oh, I, I fucked up my ledge chest and my reload. Oh, I 
Didn't want a fair. No. Oh, we'll oh God. Oh. Ow. Oh no. Back me. Ugh. Ugh. I didn't work. No. I'm only in legend. Oh, it doesn't work. Fawn's purple. <laughs> Boom! Oh, you can jump in there. I'm awesome. Oh. dead. Heart's alright, oh, alright. I've got, I've got more ammo. Exactly. That was just a... I don't know. Honestly, sometimes I think it's just worth it to Resource take a blood gone. reload. And then... Like, get hit and reload anyway. And just try to be really bad. Oh, I... Recover right <laughs> shield you did bear way later than I expected. Yeah, the delaying aerials on, on shield is so, so powerful. Especially in a game with power shields and pieces. Ow. Loading? Oh. Ow. <laughs> Man, I, I can't wait until they change Fallen. <laughs> Same. I actually really like Fallen's kit outside of, like, fair. The good moves. Yeah, outside of the, the insane moves. I just don't like, I don't know. She's She feels like she's supposed to be like a grounded, like, special cancel character. Um, but then all of her best moves are aerials. And her her tilts are kind of mediocre. I mean, whenever like I, I try to like learn, whenever I like play brawl, and I I do like just want to like be the guy that can like like jab, f tilt, down b, stuff. But yeah, <laughs> right. It's, it's hard. It's like much. It's like much more like gratifying to just like bear someone and kill them. Yeah, it's like, also ten thousand times better. Yeah, and in a tournament, like why would you not do that? You know. Oh, I thought I was safe. It's, it's just unfortunate. Yeah. Alright. Can Last I game. prevent the 3 0? Let's see. <laughs> you got this. Alright. What character? Jenny. Alright, Bonkage, what Jenny skin am I playing? Can you do like the the one with like the green like like the green uh What alien or whatever? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Cam Jenny, yes. Yeah, the like a I've come around Shout on this out. skin. I always Thank used God. to. I always used to judge like Psycho for playing the skin. I was like, bro, the skin's awful. I've come around. Look it up. This is the skin's nice. I this like is like one of my most pit played Jenny skins now. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yes. Oh wait. Oh, I messed uh, up. And they call this guy number not one. Not Johan. <laughs> not Johan moment. <laughs> I wish. Bro, Johan, <laughs> Johan is like the lamest punish game, but it, he just goes for the guaranteed stuff. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> hell yeah, you take that. <laughs> oh. It's sick when he does it though. It is. <laughs> we like it when he does that. Agreed, because it's fish, and fish is awesome. Bye. If you full hop hold fair one more time, I'm gonna pull my hair out. <laughs> oh. Oh. Bye. Ow, ow, ow. Bonk. Oh, Walrus is asking if you want to play Devil's Mouth. Uh, I'm gonna eat. I have stuff to do after <laughs> this. <laughs> oh, dead! Oh, the power shield. Oh. <laughs> I, I power shielded it, still didn't get to punish it. Oh, that sucks. Wow. Oh yeah, get up attack still counts the game, or the game still counts that as you being on ledge, so people cannot grab it. Fun fact for the stream, you didn't know that. Oh. <laughs> God. Careful not. Why didn't it work? Stop throwing things. I'm out of there. See ya. Ow. One more time. Oh. <laughs> the lag spike. The lag assist. Listen, it comes free with your copy of Slap City. Do you, do I would have actually... that on land. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> I can't, I can't wait for the first land. 
<laughs> Listen, right. whatever major has high? slap, God. I'm going to it. Yeah, of course, everyone's going to it. Alright, GG's to right, hey, everyone yeah. I played against. GG's. Alright. One tournament. Congrats, Husky. Thank you, thank you. <clears throat> Alright. Well, uh, thank you to everyone who tuned in. We got like 40 something viewers, apparently? Damn, really? 47, wow. yeah. yeah. Which, like, that's, 47. that's pretty, pretty good. surprising. People actually checking out the game because of Nick. I'm, I'm done. That's it. Yeah. Shout out to Nicktoons. Didn't expect it, but I'll take it. Alright. Well, that's going to be it for the stream. Uh, thank you to everyone who tuned in. Uh, I won't see you all next week because, well, unless you're a Lethal League player, in which case I'll see you there. But next week is our crossover event with Lethal League Blaze, uh, Lethal Slap. Uh, make sure to check that out. Uh, it's going to be the big tournament of the month. Um, so, Ray will be streaming that, I believe. Oh yeah, sure, sure. Mm -hmm. um, so anyways, uh, see ya in t I'll see you all in two weeks. Uh, so see ya.